Hey everyone, how y'all doing today? Back today with another product review video. It is a flat eye flashlight. They call it the unround flashlight. I'd never really heard about this. I got it in the other the other day when I did a box opening of Shield Box. So I can leave a link to that video. Did a video on it, unboxing the May edition, May 22 edition. So, and I'd never seen the seen this before so I was just thinking that's kind of seems cool I do have an EDC flashlight that I use a lot and I I like stream lights and they've been very good to me so I don't know for sure if this is going to make it to the into the EDC but it possibly could go into a camping bag or into one of my kids one of my boys if they want a flashlight for their camping bag or for their everyday carry or whatever so maybe we'll see but anyway it's flat eye and I'll leave a link below if I can find it for you to get one find get you an Amazon link or something if I can find a find a link for it it's LED FR 250 250 lumen so it's not super bright you know I use my I use my streamlight macro stream it's a 500 lumen so it's pretty bright this is about half that bright so I mean it's good for most things that you're ever gonna need a flashlight for 250 lumen six hours I'm guessing that's of usage 27 meters and whatever those other marks mean but it is waterproof shock proof Pistol grip, high, medium, low, so three settings. It's also got the strobe function, and it's tactical polymer. So let's see what else we got here. The back of that just basically says the same thing. Just kind of tells you what, what it has. Lens technology, flathead, hyperfin cooling. Waterproof tactile switch, battery life indicator, charging port. It does come with a cable to charge it with. It looks like it's just the regular old micro SD. So it's not, or not micro SD, but the old, the old style micro USB. Pistol grip microprocessor controlled hmm. well let's break the thing open and see what we see what we got here I was kind of curious to get this thing opened I opened up that shield box a little bit ago and I wanted to just do a review on the light itself before I ripped it open so let's see if it oh, it works Obviously it works. Well, it works for a second. Didn't work now. I'm on. What if I got to charge it up first? It came on for a quick second. It's lightweight. Definitely lightweight. It's a little heavier than my than that. But being flat, it might you know fit in your pocket a little better, and it may not be as as noticeable as a round one. It's it's shorter. It's about as but it's obviously wider that way but it might actually come in handy but it doesn't look like it has you know needs to charge definitely so that's not not going to help me much on a review if a light that doesn't work right out of the package but anyway like I said it comes with that so I can't really go through the settings because it's not charged I'll have to throw this on a charger real quick and and come back for a minute okay so I got out my my little cordless deal so we can kind of check it out so here's where the charge indicator is <clears throat> excuse me it I, I broke out the instructions too while I was out just so we know what the light means because it was it was green and was blinking green there for a minute but if it's red it's charging when it turns green it's charged so after charging, remove USB. So after that little bit, we can try it and see if that works. Oh, it's still 
Still doesn't. Still didn't give us enough charge to to have it work yet. So we're gonna have to plug this thing back in. I don't know if it's gonna work while it's plugged in. So hopefully we didn't get it done. Usually stuff comes like this comes with a little bit of charge in them, so you can so you can try it out when you first get it out of the package. But apparently this one doesn't. I'm gonna have to let it charge up for a few minutes and see what happens so I'll let it charge for a few minutes and I will come right back all right well left the thing plugged in all night long and it does seem to seem to work now that's high 250 I forgot what it said secondary was and low as you can barely see that it's on on low and that's off so anyway that is that's, it works after charging it usually it didn't turn on right away I was getting a flashing green light at first but now it seems to be at least kicking on so maybe I don't know what the problem was but now it seems to be working so hi let's see what does it mean by flashing green oh that just flashing green just that's how charged it is but anyway seems to be working so still pretty sure it's not gonna take the place of my EDC streamlight streamlight in my opinion is way better but it will definitely you know I could give it to one of the boys for their bags or something their camping bags or something it's still I do like the USB chargers I like the USBs because then you don't have to worry about carrying around extra batteries. You've got a battery pack, but that'll charge anything you've got, so it doesn't really matter. But anyway, it does work. I mean, it's nice. I like it, but I don't think it's 35 bucks or whatever it said it was. I don't think I'd pay that for it when I can get a, a good stream light for just as much or a little bit more but anyway that's the video leave a comment if you've tried these or if you like them or if you don't like it you know if you've had any issues with it comment down below give the video a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed already please do every little teeny bit helps I buy everything myself I don't have any sponsors so Every inch you give helps me a mile, so all you got to do is hit that subscribe button and that thumbs up, and I greatly appreciate all of you. So, anyway, that's the video. Flat eye, unround flashlight, 250 lumen. Definitely decent, but not as good as my stream light. Anyway... That's the video. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.